but they're watching me. Some people are watching you. If you, you ever been in the world, and you come out of the world and change your lifestyle, people may not walk up to you and ask you, but they're watching you, seeing how you doing, and they say, ooh, that's your little sister. I sure don't act like she used to act. I remember, and they can remember good things. Oh, I can go way back 40 years. They pick up some stuff way back there what Sister Hunt used to do. But now they're watching and trying to figure out what Sister Hunt has done. But Sister Hunt becomes peculiar mm. to them because she changed. She's not doing what she used to do. Otherwise, she's taking care of the body on the inside. We can't just put anything in, in inside of these bodies. I know when I come out of the world, I, I used to smoke, I used to be a smoker and couldn't get to work without patting my breath to see and I got enough cigarettes before I go on the job. Mm. Because they had a cigarette machine, they were higher. If I bought them at a service station, they were cheaper. So I'd get them at the service station, <laughs> keep from buying them in the machine. Mm -hmm. Because they were in the machine. So I'd be patting. See, I got enough, but when I got saved and filled with the Holy Ghost, I don't have to pat no more. I keep on going mm. and because I don't put all that stuff back yes. in my body like I used to. People, how come you? How did you? I quit because I didn't want to keep putting that stuff in my body. That's I'm right. I'm saved now, and I gotta live like I'm saved. I'm peculiar. Mm. I'm a member of the body of Christ now, mm. so I can't do my body like I used to do it. Mm -hmm. Paul is trying to get this over to the Corinthians. They thought they were free to do anything they wanted to. Mm -hmm. Just because it's, it's there, it's I, it's, I, can, I can do what I want to. It's just like man and wife. When man gets married, he ain't, he ain't free to go out there in the world like he used to. That's right. With other women like he used to if he did. But see, some folks think they can. Mm. But when we become a member of the body of Christ, we have to act, I think Paul said, walk circumspect. Otherwise, we take care of them. And people see us going down the road or walking down the road, they've been watching us to see. If, and, and we can draw people like that. Mm -hmm. You used to do something. And you don't change, and people eyes are on you, mm. and they can see that you're still happy, and you're more happy than you used to be, mm. and still going on, and everything. They want that. How they get? What that joy they got? They got some joy that I can't get. I get mine on Friday and Saturday, but Monday and Tuesday, <laughs> and it's, it's gone. But your joy stays. My God. Because you got it on the inside of you. Mm -hmm. Christ on the inside of you, the whole world. Yeah. So they wondering what what is keeping them going so laughable and people can't make them mad like they used to. Mm -hmm. So we got to show all that stuff. And we can't do it if we don't put everything in our body. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See, this is what the world don't understand. They keep putting all that they feed in the body mm -hmm. with junk. Mm -hmm. Wine, alcohol, smoking, mm -hmm. going on, and they're always down. Something wrong with me. And, and you just keep the word in you, feeding it, your spirit man with the word, and you still alive. Mm -hmm. Still king. You still got your strength. Still got your yes. joy. As they used to say that like that model team. Keep them knocking, keep on, uh, no, the time is. Takes a licking but keeps on ticking. Take the licking but keep on ticking. Why? Because you got some joy on the inside of you. Yeah. Ain't putting everything in you. And this is one reason that Paul was explaining to the church here mm. that they couldn't do like they thought they could. They thought they were free to do whatever I want to. So mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I'm okay, I'm 21 hours. Just because we're 21 don't mean that we got freedom to do what we want to. Amen. Let's get a saint belong to the body of Christ. Amen. We got to act like we belong yes, to the body of Christ. Lord, yes. Some folk can get out of church this afternoon and go in a Walmart and cuss like the people in, in their acting. Amen. Mm. 
It's oh. an M.M. of the body of Christ. Well, yes. Well, see, that, that, that shouldn't even be in us. Yes. And we are a member of the body of Christ. We're supposed to act like Christ. Yes. Act yes. like Him and think of that. Do, try to think that. What would Christ do mm -hmm. Mm. in a situation like this? Otherwise, don't be so haste to speak. Yes. Slow down and let the word come to you. Yes. 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 God is spirit that uh, guides you. Amen. All right, let's, let me move on. <coughs> All right, number 16 verse says, What know ye not that he which is joined to an hollow is one body? Yes. Or two sets. He is one flesh. How can we bring them? Uh, we're not supposed to even act like hollows in the church. Uh, hollow people. Otherwise, we ain't be supposed to be looking that way. Amen. Mm. Well, we're supposed to have blind folders on our glass. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. We can see right. and don't see. Come on. Well, if things go to tempting you, tip, look up in yes. the sky. <laughs> That's right. Amen. <laughs> That's, right. That's, That's right. right. That's right. Paul's yes. getting on and said, flee. Youthful love. Youthful love. Otherwise, flee means you get away from it. Yeah. Fail. 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 Yeah. Amen. Any way to get away from you for love. If yes. you ain't, since some folk can't control yes. certain people, Amen. if you ain't got that strength, yes. flee from it. Mm. Mm. That's the truth. Amen. All right. But he that John has said to the Lord is one spirit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. John might say to the Lord, no, nah, I got to ask about the Lord. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I can't come in here cussing and joking and jesting. I'm in the church now. I belong to the Lord. That spirit does die. Yeah. Because I'm in the Lord. Now I ain't got no business acting like I used to act Amen. in the world. If I do, I need to get the folks said another dip. Another dip. That's right. <laughs> Amen. Yes. Isn't that right? Yes. Y'all yes. come up here and pray for me because my spirit done. I ain't got the joy. I ain't got the control like you. Amen. Mm. I need hands laid on me and and get delivered from that spirit. Yes. That's right. And go on with the Lord because you're going to. Uh, you're, you're a member of the body mm. of Christ now. Yeah. Let me throw in a little bit of background. Here. The Corinthians also had a slogan in their culture that they live by the by Paul. Oh, let me read that again. The, the Corinthians, mm -hmm. the Corinthians also had a slogan in their culture that they live by uh, that they live by until Paul challenged them. The first slogan Paul take to issue with was. A, peculiar, a peculiar, popular. popular saying among the Christians, all things are lawful unto me. Mm. This was a such command. Did you wear on that? Read that for me. This was such a common refrain in the Koran, Koran that Paul quotes it twice in his address. Mm -hmm. Continue. Mm -hmm. Continue. The Corinthian Christian used this phrase to argue that they could do as they pleased, and there was no reason for them to stop indulging themselves mm. in whatever gave them pleasure. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See, the next time I think it was free to do that. Yeah. I can do what I'm See, you know, I remember coming up and and when, before I got grown and I could hear people say, I'm grown now, I can do what I want to. I'm 21 now. And that got on to me. Mm. I thought I'd be so glad when I get 21 mm -hmm. that I can do what I want to because those, those people that say they're grown, they can do what they want to. I thought that was something Ooh. real good mm. Mm -hmm, that they were putting down. But at this time, I thought if people thought that was real good. And they can continue on when they join the church. Amen. Mm. And I thought that when I get 21, I can do what I want to yeah. and nobody's going to bother me. I'll be free to do what I want to And I'll be all right. But that wasn't so. We got to come under, if we're going to be in the body of Christ, we got to come under the guidelines. We can't yes. just go in there and just 
Move the wrong, I'm grown now. I'm in the church. Hey, I know Jesus. Mm-hmm. What mm-hmm. about it? Mm. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I know Jesus. Some folks are like that. Amen. They uh, cuss you out and say they say. Amen. Mm. They'll pick a fight yeah, and cuss. That's the truth. The Walmart click out and say they say. Mm. <laughs> Oh yeah, I'm saying right up going to the church right down the street. But see all that stuff supposed to be washed out. Come on. Mm. They even said purge me with his and I'm clean me up. Otherwise all that stuff is gone. gone. Yes, mm. clean. Especially when I got saved, yeah. he done laid his hand on me and delivered yes. me from no mm. thoughts that should come in come on come in my mind. Come on. But we don't supposed to think like we used to. He even right. told us what to think in Philippians. Come on, come on. How to think. Yes, he did. And and we are fully, if you're still thinking like you used to, go down on the altar. I start to deliver you. Yeah. There ain't no harm in asking God to deliver you yes. if you're still thinking like you used to. Just to get it straight. Yeah. And try to be right. Right. Because people are watching. Right. And we do not want someone to stumble over us. Amen. Saying that we're living for Jesus and we're not. Right. That's if right. If you handle somebody down here, God you got a whipping stick in the corner That's for right. you. Uh-huh. Because you blocking somebody could come to the Lord. Uh-oh. But looking at you. And if they're looking at you and you're drawing them, mm-hmm. God has got some. Look, it's in the corner for you. Mm-hmm. You're living a life. Yes. Be the wrong people to God. All right, well, we know. That's good work, though. What was it? Oh, we should be interested in glorifying Christ, not our self gratification. Amen. Yeah, well, I, I like what that writer put in here. Mm-hmm. We should be interested in glorifying Christ yeah. and not ourselves. I mean, right, right. Folk lift up their self more than they do yes. Jesus. That's the truth. They want people to look at them and lift them up more than they Come do on, Jesus. Uh, look at me. Look at what I got. Look at what I'm going. I got a pocket full of money. <laughs> glorify and don't glorify the one that blessed him to get. Amen. Well, he the one to be lifted up. Break on Jesus, not yourself. Amen. Amen. Mm-hmm. Amen. In that Corinthian slogan, Paul addressed is the meat for the belly and the belly for the meat. This is how Corinthians justified their intention to satisfy any of all their cravings. This expression was not to live it simply simple eating what they wanted it was more matter of doing what they wanted mm-hmm. mm. otherwise they, it wasn't just a simple matter of eating what they wanted but it was a matter of doing what they want mm. i can do what i want mm-hmm. yeah i go i praise god and i get on i go to the club <laughs> what i want <laughs> Mm-hmm. Just what I want. Some folks think they are just because I come in the house of God mm-hmm. on Sunday morning mm-hmm. and give God 15 minutes. Mm-hmm. Now I can go to the club Where you go? and be all right. Because God going to look over me going to the club mm-hmm. and I don't praise God That's 15 minutes now. I'm all right. <laughs> don't pay the price for what I'm going to do the rest of the day. Mm. Wow. <laughs> Mm. Amen. Some folks think it's all right. It's yeah. all right. Yeah, I'm in the right place. Yes. <laughs> yes. Amen. I don't went to church now and come back home and do what I want. Mm-hmm. Amen. No, that ain't what that word. We, 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 we get some old teaching. Then we can go home and be a better Christian than yes. we were before yes. we left. Hallelujah. Better Christians. Amen. Because well, I done been to church. It'll, Come on. Do you know when you go to Cole and Corral, mm-hmm. if you're really hungry, mm-hmm. I'm talking about if you're hungry, <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. uh-huh. and Come sit on. down and eat and go back and get you some more, come out. When you come out, you feel better yeah. 
than you did when you went in there, yeah. and your body ain't gonna control you like it did before you went there. <laughs> Why are you full now? You don't need to get up. You don't need to do this. You know, you full. Praise God. That's when right. you get full of the word, uh huh. Good teaching, and let that word abide in you. Then you ain't gonna. Be, let that old talk come up in you because you yeah. can't control it. That's all right. Now. That's right. Oh, the words said you don't have that problem. Oh, the words said that. You can all know the words how I can call on Jesus at the day of mm -hmm. trouble and he'll be yes. asking me. That's right. Jesus is my help. He said, I'm very That's present right. in the time That's of right. trouble. Mm -hmm. Quote that word to that body. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that body will settle down. Tell it, tell Hallelujah. it. You put that, well, I'm talking about on your own. Sir. Yes, sir. When you get to thinking bad thoughts, <coughs> you put right. that word on your own, sir. Mm -hmm. Quote it to yourself. Come on. And you'll hear yourself saying what the Bible said, and you watch that flesh. Come on. That flesh come down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <coughs> That's right. Amen. Anybody else have a thought right now? Yes. Man. Members of the body. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. That's right. You know, last night the the, the word. Well, good morning. Not uh, just flying in there. Yes. Uh, good morning. It's house of prayer. God blessing everybody. Um, I was reading about that last night where the mm -hmm. members of the body. Um, yes. You know, if one member can't say that it don't need the other. And I was reading how the eye can't say. What is, I think it was Paul saying, if the eye was a whole body, uh -huh. what is what is the purpose of the eye? It can't do anything but just be an eye. Right. So mm -hmm. the body of Christ is of many members. Yes. You know. So that's a part that we need to learn how to understand. Yes. Where every member is needed yes, in the indeed. body. You, we can't do one thing without it. And then we found out he said that Christ is the whole. Yes. Body. And I enjoyed that because it made the difference to my understanding mm -hmm. that the Christ is all of us mm -hmm. operating in his body. Mm -hmm. And so I said, well, the hand can't say it don't need the foot, and the foot can't say it don't need the hand, because mm -hmm. it'd be operating some kind of opposite way. Mm -hmm. But God ordained the body the yes. way it is. And he ordained the uh, ministering gifts. Mm -hmm. I had to uh, read a little bit more about what ministering Ministering means, mm -hmm. gifts means, each one of us has mm -hmm. a gift. Not everybody has all the gifts, mm -hmm. but he said each gift is a call for each gift. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I was just like, well, thank you, Lord, for more understanding. we got to learn how to have more understanding. Yes. Don't be just one track mind all the Amen. time. we got to learn how to obey and respect one another in the body of Christ. Because yes. there's things God is doing that other people have nothing to do with. Your calling is not my calling. Right. So we have to understand and respect each and every one of our calling mm -hmm. so we can get busy in the body of Christ. Yes, yes, and when yes. we're called, mm -hmm. we can go. Yes. We can't go when we're not ready. Amen. Some people, like they say, they go mm -hmm. and go somewhere and they're not called to go there. Mm -hmm. And they mess up what the calling Amen. was to be. So I just thank God that you were mentioning the flesh is a, the flesh should tell you something. Try it. Uh, Brother Randy was here last, what was that, like two weeks ago, ministering on the fast, and I took him right up on it. I went right back, because we used to fast. I don't know what, I'm, I'm saying I. Yes. And it does something. It really humbles your 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 mind to God, mm -hmm. because if you gobble, 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 eating, 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 you can't hear nothing, and you don't feel right after the whole day, because you ain't, there's something missing. Right. And so I, I took on him Monday. And I said, Lord, I need to do this. I mm -hmm. need to fast. I do. And I'm going to admit it because I hadn't been. And I got into that one. T I work 12, 10 hours a day. And I'm around people that don't believe in God. Mm -hmm. But that fast kept my mind yeah. off of everybody's business going around me. Yeah. I wasn't talking all day. But they were, what's wrong with you? I said, I'm all right. Because mm -hmm. that flesh was working on me. And I said, God, this is a blessing to be able to drink some water and oh, yeah. go on through the day. And you know, I didn't think I could make it. Mm -hmm. I said, the Lord said, you're going to make it because yes. I'm with you. Mm -hmm. So I was able to go through that. But it was a tax doing that. Yes, Ain't that something? Mm -hmm. You get attacked, I think, more with fasting mm -hmm. than uh, just eating all day. So I'm going to shut up. 
<laughs> but I just wanted to say that flesh is something. I mean, it just wears up. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. um, thank you, ma'am. Amen. Mm -hmm. Anyone else has a thought right here? We are members of Christ. I think. I think God. Uh, yes, ma'am. In the house. Mm -hmm. In His house. I thank God for the house yes. of faith. And I will uh, listen for today. Is member the member of Christ? And as the, you know, word to say, we are the members of yes. Christ. Mm -hmm. We are. And, and I'm listening to Paul the same, in the black number one, I mean, the sixth verse. Mm -hmm. All things are lawful unto mm -hmm. me. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is my point of view. When he said, all things are, uh, all things are lawful to me. Obvious, but I said he was saying, well, God, when God forbid anything, it never, you know, to be allowed. Mm -hmm. And like the, the Corinthian, like he said, they had a slogan. Mm -hmm. and, and it was, <laughs> the slogan was, everything is permissible. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, they was, you know, and yeah. why they would do this mm -hmm. <laughs> to justify their behavior. Yeah, uh, why they had it. And you know, as a, a believer, we are a believer. Yes. We should have uh, self control. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. We should have self control. Mm -hmm. and, the, and the Spirit will give you that. Yes, you know, it will. Uh, yes. With the Thank faith you that you have, mm -hmm. you know, and it, it will give you that self control. We are not to be a slave to anything that God forbid. We're, right. we're not supposed to be a slave to mm -hmm. anything God forbid. And, and uh, you know, in our message, it says, we, you know, people think, you remember Joseph? Yes. When he was in that situation, how he was from the bottom. Yes, I did. And we should do that. Mm -hmm. In other words, we have that self-control. We yes. be able, you know, to flee. Yes. We uh, do mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. And uh, <coughs> but, uh, that's what I said, the example of mm -hmm. Jesus when he was flee. And so we should make that be our habit in fleeing from anything yes. that displeasing to the right. Lord. Yes. Mm-hmm. We're supposed to do that. Mm-hmm. And, uh, and like that, we say, our body is the temple. Mm -hmm. It is the temple of the Lord. And we, and we're, we're supposed to, I say, to keep this body up. I'm going to suggest it to yes, any, any, any type of sin, right. you know. Mm -hmm. but, um, in other words, <laughs> to me, our body is sacred to me. Yes, it is. It is. Mm -hmm. Very sacred. Very you know, sacred. like when we're taking the communion, yes. that's what it's like. Yes. And our body is yes, sacred, yes, too. Yes, yes. Right. Just came, mm -hmm. I mean, use this body. Do it anything. don't mean, really be belongs to us. It belongs yes, to Jesus. God. Yes, it does. And, and he so we just can't use it. I mean, anything you uh, <laughs> do of this body that contributes to God mm -hmm. is a sin. Mm -hmm. You just can't defile this, this mm -hmm. body. And uh, it really... Amen. Oh, that's all. Oh. Thank you, ma'am. Our, our subject says members mm -hmm. of Christ. It didn't say member of Christ. Yes. It says members <laughs> of uh -huh. Christ. Uh -huh. And let us know that it's more than just one, one. member. Mm -hmm. yeah. Praise God. That's right. Uh, this temple of ours. 
have many members on it, mm. fingers and toes, hands and foot and eyes and head and, you know, yes. uh, all, all of this. Mm -hmm. uh, praise God. And if you, you stump your toe, your whole body feels it. Mm. Uh, praise God. And so, so we as members of Christ, we are one in Him. Mm -hmm. and, and if Christ's Spirit is in us, yeah. My God. His spirit, if his spirit is in us, it'll mm -hmm. show on the outside of us. Amen. Mm -hmm. Praise God. Come on. And you can tell when someone have Christ's spirit on the inside yes. of them. Because it shows on the outside yes. and they're That's sweet, right. and kind, yes. and, and uh, considerate, and all of them. Praise God. When people are saying that they're saved, mm -hmm. And uh, they're mean as a rattlesnake and doing all of this. Mm -hmm. We know that his spirit is not in there. It ain't there. Yes. Amen. Praise God. Glory to God. <laughs> and and yeah. uh, uh, if 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 uh, uh, if you're a child of God, you are supposed to act like a child of God. Yes. Amen. And uh, Paul is uh, letting them know all of the things that the Corinthians was doing. Mm -hmm. uh, they were all about self. Yes. They didn't have yeah. no self control. Mm -hmm. They just all about self doing yes. what self want to do. Mm -hmm. And was saying, This is my body and I can do whatever yeah. I want yes. to uh, with it. Well, as a ch in the world you can. Amen. Praise yeah. God. In the world you can do yeah. whatever you want to. Yeah. Praise God. But in God's uh uh uh, children, as God's children, mm -hmm. we can't do whatever we want to do. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Praise God, because this body is is no more ours; it belongs to God. Yes. Mm -hmm. And and uh, we are to act like Him. Yes. Amen. Uh, the the uh, Corinthians, uh, uh, Paul made that example about uh, me for the belly, oh. belly for the meat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He was. Uh, it was a parable <laughs> to let let them. Uh, see and 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 uh, mm -hmm. uh, know mm -hmm. uh, they were desiring desiring a sexual thing mm -hmm. and and uh, they was uh, craving you know how your body crave for food yeah. mm -hmm. and uh, um, you uh, uh, feed your body mm -hmm. uh, praise God come on body's hungry you feed it yeah. Yeah. praise God yeah. and so uh, Paul made this example Mm -hmm. uh, them, they were uh, craving, uh, craving for sex mm -hmm. and, and uh, sexual mm -hmm. desires mm -hmm. and, and, and and all, and uh, they were uh, God made man and woman. Yes, come on. And and uh, uh, He gave them a sexual desires for each other. Right. Yes. Praise yes. God. You hear what I said? But each other. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Each other, uh -huh. mm -hmm. praise God. It's not for the husband and wife and somebody else. Mm -hmm. It's for each other. Right. Yeah. Two. Praise God. Yeah. And he was uh, 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 talking about uh, them uh, fornicating. Come on. We know mm -hmm. that a person that is uh, fornicate is unmarried person. Right. Right. Yes. Praise God. Having uh, unlawful sex. Mm -hmm. Right. Praise God. And so, so. Paul was breaking all of this down mm -hmm. for them to see what condition they were in. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. Uh, praise God. And and uh, God's people, uh, a lot of them today are in the same fix. Yes, Lord. In the church world, mm -hmm. yes. in the same fix. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, preachers have their wives and a sweetheart on the side. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. And have outside children uh -huh. yes. and all of this. Okay. And all of this is the same what it was mm -hmm. back then, it's here today. Yes. Mm -hmm. Praise God. Yes. Glory yes. to God. Yes. And God's word, what uh God's word is true, whether anyone live it or not, yes. his word is true. All right. true. And, all right. and um and uh um God uh made man and woman to have sex. Mm -hmm. uh, but, a husband and wife, yes. right? and uh, 
that's a, a righteous thing mm -hmm. because God made it that way. Amen. Mm -hmm. But when it's out from that, mm -hmm. praise God, then that's when it's wrong. Mm -hmm. yes. Praise God. It's, Come on, it's saying here in uh, uh, 18, mm -hmm. 6 and 18, mm -hmm. said, flee from a fornication. Yes. Yes. Every sin that a man doeth mm -hmm. is without the body. Yes. But he that committed fornication, hear what the word saying. Mm -hmm. Come on. But he that committed fornication sinned against his own body. Mm -hmm. mm. Praise God. Uh -huh. Why it's saying, saying that it sinned against his own body. Uh -huh. When it fornicate, you can come up with diseases, mm -hmm. uh, uh, all kinds of different kind yes. of things Amen. that you can have. Right. Mm. Praise God. A woman can get a uh, pregnant, uh, uh, unwanted pregnancy mm -hmm. out of out of the fornication. Come on, tell it. And all of this, this sinful stuff. Yes. Yes. See that sin. Yes. Praise yes. God. Come on. But when a husband and wife mm -hmm. have sex and have children, that that's that's what God gave them mm -hmm. to do this. This is Come a holy on. thing, a righteous thing. Yes. yes. Praise yes. God. Yes. But yes. when you yes. get away from that, mm -hmm. and and you know, sinners are doing this, mm -hmm. having babies and not married and all of that, yeah. that's sin. Yes. It is. Praise God. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. That is sin. Mm -hmm. And God don't don't uh, um, want things to happen like that in the church house. That's oh, right. And the, and the Corinthian Ooh. was just just outrageous. Yes, <laughs> doing all kinds of uh, wicked sex. Yes. Uh, uh, Come on. Not the way God wanted uh, man and woman, mm -hmm. but they were doing all kinds oh, of uh, 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 sexual mm -hmm. uh, immorality. Mm -hmm. Praise God. And Paul was trying to get them straight on that. Uh -huh. yes. Praise God. So they could go on with the Lord. Yes. yes Praise yes, God. Yes. If, 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 if you are, are, are sinning, mm -hmm. God is not with you. No. Okay. You are out there by yourself when yes. you're sinning. That's right. Praise yeah. God. When, uh, then you have to repent mm -hmm. and ask God to forgive you. Mm -hmm. And then he'll accept you back. Mm -hmm. Praise you. God. Glory to God. Man. And, and, and uh, uh, all of this, see, we need all of this. Thank because you. it's happening in the church. Yes, it is. Uh, uh, praise God. A lot of people don't even want to say anything about that. Mm -hmm. They know all of this stuff that's going on. Yeah. Praise God. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, uh, it's, how would uh, 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 a sinner know to do better if it's not taught? Yes. People Amen. know to do better That's good. if it's not taught. Mm -hmm. Amen. Praise God. Glory to God. Wow. And and uh, you can take a, a good thing mm -hmm. and make something bad out of it. Yes. Okay. Praise yes. God. That's good. And sex is a good thing. Yes. yes. In its place. Yes. In its place. But you can take yeah. that and make Tell something it. bad out of it. Yeah. Yeah. Praise yeah. God. That's Glory to word, God. Man. And so, so, um, and Paul is letting them know That's right. uh, that this is wrong. Come on. Uh, uh, praise God. And, and, and uh, 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 teaching them. Mm -hmm. And you know, uh, a lot of things uh, God's people are supposed to know, oh, yes. but they're still doing these things. Yes. They're okay. being rebellious against the word. Mm -hmm. Come on. They're fighting against, uh, uh, fighting against the word. Uh -huh. uh, praise God. Mm -hmm. And and uh, says, we is we exist for God's purpose. Yes, Ooh, that's beautiful. Not our own. Not our own. We Not owe own. our lives to God and are subject to Him. Yes. Because he bought us with the price. Yes. Thank you. And prepared us for holiness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Paul stated that God raised, raised Jesus up and will also raise us up uh -huh. uh, by his power. Mm -hmm. Just as God raised Jesus from the dead, he will also raise us. Yes. What right do we have then to pollute? the body mm -hmm. that he owned and preserved for a glorious mm -hmm. uh, eternity. Mm -hmm. So we are completely subject to him, mm -hmm. not ourselves. We are subject to him mm -hmm. and our works will be judged. There will be no excuse. Mm -hmm. Praise God. 
that's what uh, Paul was uh, trying to uh, get them to know. Mm -hmm. It's no excuse for not living holy. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Glory to God. We have, we uh, hear, hear the word over the radio, television, mm -hmm. and in the churches, and all. Mm -hmm. And there's no excuse for us to live any kind of way that Amen. we want to live. Right. Praise God. Because the word goes forth. Yes. Praise God. And it's to, up to each individual to make a choice. Yes. Yes. Make a choice. Cho the, uh, uh, Joshua said, choose you this day yes, whom right. you will serve. Mm -hmm. yes. Praise God. Mm -hmm. he, he wants you to make up your mind. All right. Praise God. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, not to be uh, driven by self-will. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Praise God. Uh, self-will uh, 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 gets you in a fix. We are not supposed to be selfish about nothing. Yes. Praise God. Right. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, the Lord help, I, I say, uh, but Lord help my desire yes. to be holy, uh -huh. yes. righteous, and just. Yes. Help my desire. Yes. Yes. Praise God. I don't want to have uh, uh, desires of on, adultery good. and, and uh, yes. all of this kind of stuff. Yes. Help my desire to be righteous, mm. uh, 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 holy, That's and good. just. Yes. Praise God. That's and and uh, if you keep yeah. that in view, praise mm -hmm. God, you won't go wrong for uh, holiness, uh, and righteous, and, mm. and justice. Yeah. Uh, praise God. The justice when you uh, uh, do people right. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, you treat people the way that you would them to treat you. That's mm -hmm. right. See, a lot of times, uh, uh, even in the church, and then got in the church, mm -hmm. uh, people think they can treat people any kind of way. My God. Talk to people any kind of Amen. way. Amen. Praise mm -hmm. God. Glory to God. Amen. Uh, uh, you can get more flies, catch more flies mm -hmm. with, with honey than you can with vinegar. Yes. My God. Praise God. Yes. Glory yes. to God. And that's been a strong will yes. of talking of people down. Amen. Praise God. You can say something and it's how you say it yeah. can yeah. hurt a person. Yes. It may be the right thing that you're saying, yeah. you. but the way that you, yeah. you're yeah. saying yeah. it. Praise God. I remember yeah. this lady was uh, uh, told about uh, this mm -hmm. uh, man had a son mm -hmm. and he was away. Uh -huh. And this uh, man couldn't read. Mm -hmm. So the son uh, sent his father a letter, mm -hmm. and he was in need. He need. Uh, he was in need, mm -hmm. and he was wanting his father to send him uh, some money. Mm -hmm. And so uh, he had someone to read read the uh, letter uh, to him. Mm -hmm. And uh, this person who had read that letter, it sounded like it was a demand, mm -hmm. and the father didn't didn't appreciate that. Mm -hmm. And he said he wasn't going to, you know, say nothing. So someone else read that. And the way that person uh, read that, uh, he was glad to be able to mm -hmm. help his son. Right. See, it's not so much what you say, <laughs> yeah. it's how you say it. Yes. Yes. Praise yes. God. That's Glory good. God. Oh my God. And we have to we have to 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 uh uh Speak with the uh, uh, voice of Christ, yes. with love in our voice. Yes. Praise God! Don't uh, uh, a dog don't want you to uh, uh, yell at them. Get away from me, dog! <laughs> get away from here! <laughs> you see him uh, with his head down, his little tail wagging, and get Aww. away. He don't like that, mm -hmm. and that's just an animal. Mm -hmm. yeah. What you think about a human? Mm -hmm. When you you are talking down to them, my God. And see, we are members of Christ, and we are to act like we are. Right. Uh, praise God. God. Our lives are supposed yes. to be built on the foundation of Christ. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Not not on on uh, uh, our selfish desires. Mm -hmm. uh, praise God. Mm -hmm. Glory to God. And right. this this we need this. Yes, we do. We need yes, this, yes, this yes, blessing. Yes, yes, we, yes. Uh, actually, we need them all. <laughs> but the world need to hear yes, about yes. Uh, what Paul is trying to get over mm -hmm. the people mm -hmm. uh, in this lesson. Yes, that's so, real. saints, yes, be encouraged. Be encouraged. Hallelujah. And thank you. Amen. Uh, mother, I'm not disrespecting you, uh -huh. but I would like to have some 
Man. I don't like the hell. Some words? Yes. Go right here. Uh, okay. Now, it's I'm not even expecting you now. Mm -hmm. I just want to say something. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the way Paul concludes, you know, this method is to say we should glorify, should glorify God in our body. Yes. Yes, and we should glorify. In other words, use your body to please God. Use it to please God. Yes. And, a, and another thing, the way we live, it does matter to God. Mm -hmm. The way we live matters to God. Mm -hmm. And it can, you know, cause an impact on others, mm -hmm. you know, of our lifestyle. Mm -hmm. If we're not living to please God, it can hinder someone. And if we are living to please God, it'll be helpful, you know, to yes. our individuals. So we have to be careful how we we confess that we are a child of God. Yes. But we have to put it in action. By putting it in action, it's living according to God's word. Yes. Thank you, Father. Not mankind, but not to God. Mm -hmm. Are you finished? Yes. Oh, thank you. Thank you, man. You, you know, um, speak, I'm thinking on the slogans. Slogans can get you in a whole lot of trouble. Mm. <laughs> Sometimes we, <laughs> you, they had a slogan going on the TV. Mm -hmm. I can't just pass one of these potato chips. I had to eat the whole thing. I go out and get big in the house. Slave. Ain't got no self control mm -hmm. over himself. Paul said, I won't let these things put me under them. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm gonna be other they're not gonna bring me down. Just because I may do it. Yeah. You gotta have some self control yeah. over your own body. You got to speak to your own body sometimes. Tell your own body that you don't need that. You don't That's need right. to put this in your body. All the time. Yes. Don't let your body tell you you got to have it. Mm. Come on. Well, you ain't got to have it. You don't got to have nothing but bread and water. Authority. Amen. You got to have that stuff. Yes. But these other things you don't have to have. You get correcting church free now. Mm. Once we learn these things, what things in the world can bring us down and if and, and we got no self-control if we don't know the word we can't do the word yes but once we know the word then we're going to be held accountable for not doing the word yes and so once we and the wife said well come on. we come in here we hear the word every sunday and every time we come here if it's in the preaching going on you can hear the word That's yes right. because it's going to come out of the bible mm -hmm. It don't come out on no almanac. <laughs> <laughs> Mother yes. used to yes. use that phrase a lot. <laughs> if you got the right kind of Bible, mm. come on. she used to use that phrase. It's coming out of the Bible. Amen. Whether you Thank receive you it or not, yes. Yes. you're going to hear the word here. That's right. And, and if you don't do the word, it's to you. That's right. My God. That's right. And you ain't got no... Uh, what the, you got nothing to stand on when you fall Come on, down. That's say, good. Oh, they didn't treat me. Oh, you're wrong. They mm -hmm. did teach you. Yeah. You just didn't receive. There you go. My God. So Paul had a hard time trading these church people out because they had been living on the slope. Mm -hmm. What I can do, I can do it. I'm grown up 21. <laughs> I can do it. Like I said earlier, mm -hmm. when I heard that phrase and I was a boy, when I get grown, 21, I do what I want. But when I got 21, I realized, uh huh? Yeah. No, I ain't going to still can't do it. Just because I heard that slogan, it wasn't the right type right. of slogan. Mm -hmm. They were teaching, but I just fell under that thinking that when I get 21, I'm going to be able to do uh huh. Mm -hmm. No. We got to live by this word, uh -huh. not just talk this word. Hallelujah. You do this word, not just to hear this word. I'll say you only justify when you do it. Mm -hmm. Amen? Amen. Anybody else has a thought before we call Ella Rodney members of Christ? I'd like to read the 
Thank you. Yes, ma'am. <coughs> Deceitfulness in our daily behavior, avoiding immoral and corrupt behavior, and the lack of devotion to the word, to prayer, and to serve others as they have need. I'm so happy when I woke up this morning and I realized that you gave me my confirmation, Dad Brian. Mm-hmm. When you said that people want to take the joy out of it. Uh, I have been doing that this week. Yes. Every time I watch the TV, it was a uh, check of wealth. And I've been uh, just digging back my notes. Yes. And I was just thanking God that He sent three apostles yes. to this church. Mm-hmm. And that was a message for us. Yes. And I sure received it too. Mm-hmm. Ooh, I, was, I just been joyful. Mm-hmm. Uh, I've been trying to contain myself, but at the same time, I'm getting attacked. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 I'm so tearful mm-hmm. because it didn't work. That's right. Within. Mm-hmm. Uh, because I've been in the world. Yeah. That's that help me mm-hmm. Ooh, to calm my spirit mm-hmm. and not react as I used to. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And you gave me my confirmation. And I, I thank God for waking up today. Yes. And on my way to church, I just got even more happy. Mm-hmm. And I know why. Mm-hmm. I got to come and get my confirmation. Mm-hmm. Thank you yes. for this. Mm-hmm. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> Once again, members of Christ, but what we, we are together, we've now been brought out by hands and body, what was it, function together? You know what, well, I can't, I'm a member of the body of Christ, I'm a member of Christ, I can't go over here and act like I yes. don't belong to the revival center, I don't mm. go over here and act God. like this over here because I'm not over there. Uh huh. The uh-huh. same spirit will be everywhere That's you go. It. We gotta act like we are member of Christ. Yes. We can't just. I used to work when I was on the workforce when a long years ago. A young man was trying to tell me that his pastor said he could do everything he wanted to, as long as he was on the end of the church. I said, well, you need wow. to set some kind of example mm. when you're not at church. I said, how are you going to get anybody in the church and you out here in the world doing anything and everything oh you want to do God. and not acting like the body of Christ? He said, well, long as I'm not under that roof, I said, you mm. wow. to be the same. Because you ain't set no example to the world. <laughs> You're just saying Ooh. one thing, but you're doing something else. Something else. If we're right. a member of Christ, we got to act like Christ on, wherever you at. That's right. right. Be able to that we can go from here to California because ain't nobody over there in California. You know you, you're going to act like uh-huh. the world over there in California. <laughs> Come back to Tulsa. People know you here. Mm-hmm. You act like a Christian. No. People know you wherever you are. Amen. 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 He know you wherever you are. Amen. 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 That's why the book of Isaiah said, men love darkness rather than light. Because yes, yes, they yes. think for evil. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. When I was in the world, they'd go to a club to see somebody sitting in the dark. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's because they was with somebody else. Why? Mm-hmm. Well, they don't say know that. whether they see it. I know they love darkness. I wanted the light. I want to say somewhere folk can see me. Because I ain't trying to hide nothing. You know, you're trying to hide something, but he see you wherever you go. Right. That's why if we're a member of Christ, we need to act like it over here. That's right. If you go to Africa, act like you're a member of Christ. Whatever That's you right. are. That's right. I'd like you a Christ member. Hallelujah. Elder Rodney? Yes, sir. You read you in time, sir.
Amen. All right. Our lesson today, members of Christ. Yes. Members of Christ. Our lesson text is 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verses 12 through 20. All right. So associate pastors, Dad and Mom Brian has already taught our lesson well. It's every Sunday. My assignment is to go through and review the scriptures of the lesson. You need your Bibles. So today's lesson begins about three chapters after last week's lesson. What was last week's lesson titled? Christ, Christ, our only foundation. Mm -hmm. Got into that last week. We talked about we talked about that foundation of Christ. Right? We talked about that foundation. Uh, it consists that foundation we talked last week consists of what consists of what Jesus did right on the cross. Yes. Right. Mm -hmm. And what he said. Yes. Yes. So what he did on the cross was. But what he did was his, he died, his death, burial, and resurrection. Yes. Right? God for our sins. <laughs> he was buried. We might have victory over death. Mm -hmm. and, and, and he was resurrected. And we have resurrection power Amen. in Jesus' name. Right? It's a powerful thing. That is a heart of what we believe. Yes, sir. <clears throat> That's what Jesus did. That foundation of Christ also consists of what Jesus said. Amen. Which we have clarified quite often. Jesus' only message was what? The kingdom of God. Right. Right? Mm -hmm. The gospel of the kingdom, or good news. Yes. Jesus said, uh, Jesus said, uh, the Bible says that he went out and he went and preached the gospel of the kingdom. Amen. We talked about that last week, but what is referred to as the good news. Mm -hmm. It was referred to simply as the gospel. When you see the word gospel, it's referred to the gospel of the kingdom. Yes. Okay. And, and it's a mind renewing. It's uh, the mind of Christ, mm -hmm. right? The gospel of the king. Amen. Oh, man, beautiful thing. So, Jesus' work on the cross plus the mind renewing gospel of the kingdom is our only foundation. Right? Yes. There is no other foundation that can be laid. We talked about this last week. Yes. We also talked about, in verse 13 of uh, last week's lesson, we said, every man, every man shall, every man's what shall be made manifest or brought to light. Work. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That verse goes on to say, every man's work shall be revealed by uh, fire. fire. Mm -hmm. And that fire tries, to see what sort it is, mm -hmm. and it purifies, right? Mm -hmm. That's not a bad thing. We talked about that, right? Amen. Many times we, we consider the enemy is coming against us, but many times our work is being tried uh, and yes. purified. Yes. Mm -hmm. God is a consuming fire, right? Yes, yes. God is glorified when our work is purified. Yes, He is. Mm -hmm. uh, the Bible says, Un unto the pure all things are pure. Mm -hmm. But unto the defiled, everything is a mess, mm -hmm. right? Everything is defiled. <laughs> People can look at you and think of certain things, you know, and it's, and it's not always you. A lot of times it's in their mind. That's right. Woo! Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. But I'm going to all things pure. So, so God, is pure, God is glorified when our work is purified. Yes, he is. I have written down, he that endure to the end shall be saved. All right, so in verse 15, Paul says, If any man's work of last week's lesson, if any man's work does suffer loss and be burned up, he himself shall be what? Saved. saved. Mm -hmm. Or made whole. Yes. That word saved means the original saved. word means to be made whole. Mm -hmm. By what? Fire. By fire. By fire. 
That fire is not always a bad thing. Amen. It's not always a bad thing. Oh, man. Enemy does attack, but that fire is not always a bad thing. God is a holy God, though, right? Yes, he is. Okay, on to today's lesson, uh, chapter 6. We're gonna, I'm going to start a couple verses back uh, at verse 9. Paul said in verse 9 of chapter uh, 6, Paul says, Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit what? The kingdom, the kingdom of God. Hmm. The unrighteous. Amen. The unrighteous shall not inherit or, or receive by inheritance the kingdom of God. We know Romans 4, 14, 17 gives the characteristics of the kingdom of God, which is three things, which is the Bible says the kingdom of God, God is not meat and drink, but righteousness, righteousness peace, peace yeah. and joy in the Holy Ghost. Right? Mm -hmm. Those are the characteristics of the kingdom of God, mm -hmm. uh, which is awesome. But the kingdom of God itself, we talked about this, it's good to understand this. Uh, it is God's way of doing things. Mm -hmm. This is what the kingdom of God is, right? Mm -hmm. <coughs> It's God's way. Jesus said the kingdom of God is like leaven. Mm -hmm. He said the kingdom of God is like a mustard. So he gave many references to yeah, what the kingdom did. of God is, right? Mm -hmm. This is what the gospel of the good news, uh, this is it's all about the kingdom. Yes. The only message Jesus preached. Yeah. The mind of Christ, right? That's all Jesus talked about. So verse 9 says, The unrighteous shall not inherit or be an heir to receive or benefit from God's way of doing things. Right. He said, uh, in, at the end, of, he said in verse nine, "Don't be deceived." deceived right? He Amen. said, do, "Paul says, do not be deceived." Mm -hmm. Paul goes to name ten types of people in verses nine and ten that will not inherit God's way of doing things or the kingdom of God. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go through these ten right here. What, what are these ten? The first one is adulterers. King James version said fornicators, mm -hmm. right? Adultery. Adulterer. Adulterers. Prostitutes. Uh, Effeminate. Effeminate. Mm -hmm. Of mankind. Yes, yes, yes. Thieves. 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 Covetous. Drunkards. Grabbers. Sorcerers. Mm hmm. Shall. These shall not inherit the kingdom of God. Right? I was going to go through all of those, but for the sake of time. But but God gave a list of of, of people with characteristics that will not Amen. inherit the kingdom of God. Amen. Right? Mm -hmm. uh, like we said, the gospel of the kingdom, the gospel begins with the cross. Yes. Right? You got to have the blood. We can't get to salvation, which means to be whole, spiritually first, then naturally. Nothing is supposed to be missing in our lives. This is what the word just translated. Mm -hmm. Salvation means, right? Or say, uh, this culture has taken me. But the word is translated. It's good to know what these words mean. I want to know what yes. God said. I want to know yeah. what God said. Mm -hmm. So the word is, we talk about this a lot, but the word is translated, say, or salvation means to be completely whole. Mm -hmm. yeah. God wants, God needs for you to be completely whole so you can do everything. Thing that God has called you to do the way God has called you to do it and the only way that you can do that you have to be completely whole and I always make the clarification when it comes to black people we have an issue with our history and culture but that's included in there completely whole and it don't matter what your ethnicity is but I say that because ours was stripped oh yeah but 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 salvation is to be whole, completely whole. So this is a beautiful message. Yes. Yeah, this is a beautiful message, right? <coughs> so, 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 so this is what the kingdom of God is unto. So, uh, the gospel is unto. Paul said, that, uh, "I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for the power of God unto salvation. salvation, unto salvation." You're talking about the gospel of the kingdom. Mm -hmm. The power of God unto being whole. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So. 
So Paul says, none of these people are going to enter God's way of doing things, Amen. right? They, they will not inherit. Um, they will not inherit the kingdom of God. Verse 11, Paul says, and such were who? Some of you. <coughs> Some of you or us, right? Yes. We all got it. Ain't none of us fell out of heaven. Ain't none oh, of us fell out of heaven. Amen. Right? Mm -hmm. I thank God for the testimony. Amen. <laughs> I can, I can talk about that. Right? God is good. God is good. He says, he goes on to say, but ye are what? Washed. Washed. By what? The blood. The blood. <laughs> the, oh, yes. All the blood. He continues saying, ye are what? Sanctified. Sanctified. Set apart. You're different like dad and mom were saying. We're different, right? We're not like the world. We're different. Grandma, you say you can't help nobody if you just like it. That's right. <coughs> Amen. Mm. Set apart, different. He said, ye are washed, ye are sanctified, our sins. Mm -hmm. we, we can't receive the kingdom. We can't receive salvation with sin in our lives. So that blood has to be first. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. So we get forgiven for our sins. Then we are eligible to receive salvation. Yes. Holiness. Mm -hmm. So he says, you are sanctified. He goes on to say, you are justified in what? The name, the name of the Lord Jesus. And by who? The Spirit. And by the Spirit of God. Okay, now on to our lesson, verse 12. Paul said, all things are what unto me? Lawful. Lawful. Mm -hmm. Now Paul is speaking from a mature place. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. He's speaking mm -hmm. from a mature place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He says, all things are lawful unto me, but I, I, I love his sensitivity to the people. Right? Mm -hmm. Paul continues saying, um, all things are expedient. Yes, yes. <laughs> not, 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 not. He said, not, all things are not expedient. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love that. He said, all things are not expedient. The word expedient basically means profitable. Mm -hmm. Amen. Paul is concerned about people. Yes. I have this conviction with music, mm -hmm. right? People give me a hard time in church, in church, mm -hmm. about music. Because I have this conviction about music, and as a, as a Christian listening to secular or worldly music, mm -hmm. my conviction <clears throat> is that, yes, I may think that it's okay. I, you know, God knows my heart. Mm -hmm. Grandma said, that's what makes it so serious, right? He knows your heart. <laughs> Well, see, God knows my heart, but I've always had this conviction. But if I'm witness to somebody and, 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 and the person I was witnessing, I'm sitting in my car listening to whatever, mm -hmm. and somebody comes to my window and they're just talking to me because I have been witnessing to them. Mm -hmm. And they, they're hearing Luther Vandross on my. Mm -hmm. I can think in my mind they shouldn't be judging, but they are. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Right. Right. They are going to judge. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> So what am I going to do? Well, you, I can't have that conversation with them. I got, you know. Mm -hmm. So Paul says, all things are expedient for me, right? Mm -hmm. And I said, all things are lawful for me, but all things are mm -hmm. not expedient. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So Paul says, all things are lawful for me, but I will be not, I will not be brought under what? The power of any power. The power, mm -hmm. power mm -hmm. or a slave to mm -hmm. anything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's good. Verse 13, Paul said, meats for what? The belly. Yeah. Belly and what? And the belly? Oh, this is what the this is the way the Corinthians thought, right? Mm -hmm. Eat or indulge as much as you want as long as it feels good. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it's for. It's all about me being happy. Mm -hmm. Well, no strengths, no nothing. Oh, that's that's a that's that's a slippery slope. <laughs> as a Christian, right? As a Christian, that's a slippery slope. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes, God wants us. God, God loves us, right? Yes, yeah. But Paul makes a good example. Jesus made a good example. Even Moses made a good example, yes. right? They was doing. They were sacrificing Hallelujah. for the people. Mm -hmm. Jesus said, "No greater love but had the man that he laid Amen. down his yes. life for his people." Amen. This is. Thank this is another God. level of love. Yeah. All right, so, but the Corinthians had this this way, you know, okay, meats for the belly, belly for meats. In other words, we can do anything we want, uh -huh. as long as it feels good. Mm -hmm. But Paul said, 
God will do what? Destroy to both. Destroy them both. Verse 13 goes on uh, to say, now the body is not for fornication. He said the body is not for fornication. Now, I looked up that word because like I, I want to know what these words mean. Yes. But this word here, this word fornication is just like what we've been saying. It basically means unlawful sexual intercourse. Right. Mm -hmm. That's, you know, that's just what it means. Mm -hmm. as, and as, as some other times, you know, it means some different things. But this time, mm -hmm. this is what it means, right? Yes. And it says the body is not for this. Mother made that so clear what sex was for. Right. I remember I was teaching Sunday school. And I call myself, I, this is one time I had the babies and the teenagers. I had everybody in there. Yes. And I don't remember what the lesson was about. And I had to talk about that, right? Mm -hmm. And I was so uncomfortable. Yeah. I, was so uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> I was so uncomfortable yeah. back there. And so, but, but I had to teach the lesson, right? Yes. So I call myself talking in code, right? And I'm to the older people. To the older children. Yes. I don't remember how I said it. I said something, I was trying to make the point. <laughs> That uh, sex is really a celebration of a covenant. Yes, that's good. It's a celebration of a covenant, mm -hmm. right? So I was trying to—I didn't say it, but I was trying to share it with the older children, though, right? Yes. So Pastor C.E.'s youngest boy, Caden, and he was little back then. He was in there. He was little boy. You know, he taller than all of us now. Yes. He was a little boy. C.E. takes me that evening. He said. He said, Caden told him, he said, I learned in Sunday school that uh, sex is what grown people do to have fun. <laughs> <laughs> that was his interpretation. <laughs> wow. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> These children are sharp, <laughs> but well, but 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 the body is not for fornication. Amen. Right? That wasn't yeah. the purpose. It's a beautiful thing, like Mother was saying. I appreciate that, Mother. Mm -hmm. uh, she was making so clear that's not what it's for. Mm -hmm. The body is not for fornication. The, uh, the Bible says the body is for for who? For God, for the Lord. For the Lord, verse 13 Amen. goes on and says, the body is for the Lord, and the Lord for the body, or the body of Christ. Yes, yes. Verse 14, Paul said, God will raise up who? Oh, yeah, us. Jesus. The Lord Jesus, right? And he said he will also do what? Raise yes. up yes. by his own power. Yeah. Yeah. Verse 15, he says, know ye not that your bodies are what? Members of Christ. Members of Christ. Mm -hmm. Our bodies are members yes. of one I body yes. of Christ. Mm -hmm. uh, he says, shall I take the members of Christ and make them a what? Mm. Paul said, God, go ahead. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. He said, don't you know that he which is joined to a what is one body? A harlot. Mm -hmm. He that is joined to a harlot is one body, joined, mm -hmm. right? Yes. Joined, having intercourse, joined, yes. right? With, with, it's one body. Amen. You become one. Mm -hmm. it, 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 it's really the biblical marriage was the uh, was the joining. Right? Mm -hmm. that, that was what made you one. Mm -hmm. They call it consummation. You know, your marriage is not complete until it's consummated. Mm -hmm. That's what really makes you one. So he who is joined to a harlot yes. becomes one flesh. Yes. Mm. Well. Verse 17, he that is joined to the Lord is one spirit. 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 Mm -hmm. Paul said to flee or run from what? Mm -hmm. yes. He said, flee, yes. run from it. Yes. He said, every sin that a man doeth is where? Without the body. Without the body or outside the body. Mm -hmm. 
But fornication is different because he that committed fornication against his own body. And he said, What? Know ye not that your bodies is your body is the temple of who? Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. And where is that Holy Ghost? It's the temple of the Holy Ghost. Yes. And, and you have that of who? Who gave us the God. temple? God. God. Yes. So it says, we are our own. No. 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 You are not no. your own. <laughs> Somebody paid for you, right? Amen. Verse 20 says, ye are bought with price. Priceless. Priceless. That's right. But a, a precious price. Yes. Blood of a the, 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 the blood of a perfect lamb. Yes. yes. Oh my God. Therefore, do what to your body? Glorify. In your body. Glorify. glorify who? God. God. That's the purpose. That's our purpose. It's to glorify mm -hmm. God mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. our bodies. Mm -hmm. And where else? In our spirit. In our spirits, which is whose? Uh, he said to glorify God in our bodies and in our spirits. Like like that and Mom saying, God is always watching. It don't matter if you're in Africa, it don't matter if you're in the middle of the ocean, it don't matter if you're in the church, it don't matter if you're in the store, it don't matter if you're at your boyfriend, girlfriend's house, it don't matter. It don't matter. God is always watching. I'll know it. Yes. God is always watching. So we are members of Christ. Mm -hmm. We are members of Christ. Good stuff. Good stuff. Dad and Mom, you guys have any closing thoughts? Brother Review, I uh, just kind of thought when you just said God is always watching. There was a saying this old man and his young son was going to steal some corn. Mm -hmm. And he got to the road to look both ways. Mm -hmm. And he looked both ways. And the son said, Dad, you didn't look up. Oh, so why <laughs> you didn't look up? Mm. You looked both ways, but you didn't look up. <laughs> wow. God was looking at me from a place. You looked both ways to see it. You looked that way and that way. Yeah. Coast was clear. Yeah. You didn't look up. Well, <laughs> well, that's good. Yeah. Well, that's good. Yeah. Wow. Wow. And then, yeah, he ain't, he ain't never no hiding place from, from God. Amen. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Lord. Father God. We thank you for your words. Thank, thank you, Father, that we are bodies. We are we are members of Christ. Yes, yes. Thank you, Father, for what Jesus did on the cross. Yes. We thank you for the foundation that He laid. We thank you that we have the grace to build on this foundation you, the way you want us to build to glorify you, God. Let us glorify you, God, in our spirits and in, the, and in our bodies, God. We don't want to be a stumbling block. We don't want to be a stumbling block. We thank you for what you're doing, Father. We're constantly praying for the sick and the shut-in. We thank you for what you're doing in the bodies of your people, God, for your glory. Thank you, Father, that, that by Jesus' stripes, we are healed, God. We're, we're praying for our pastor this morning, God. Yes, pastor Lord. Virginia, God, we thank you for doing the work in her body yes. right now. Rest and rest and rest, yes. restoration in her body yes. in the name of Jesus, yes. God. We thank you thank for the work you're doing in her body this yes. morning, right yes. now, by yes. your spirit. Yes. Your yes. Lord. We, thank you. we thank you for touching her body in the mighty name. We thank you for the word that's coming forth. We thank you for doing our lives for your glory, God. We thank you forever. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Amen.